Good morning. This is Thursday, June the 11th. In our upper room this morning, uh, the title of our upper room reading is Compassion and Mercy. The verses to read this morning is Hebrews 13, 1 through 3. But our focal passage this morning is found in Proverbs 31, 9. Speak up and judge fairly. Defend the rights of the poor and the needy. Well, our reading this morning was sent in by Lolly Hofer from Nebraska. And Lolly writes, My 12-year-old son, Mike, yelled for me to pull over in the parking lot. His voice was urgent. Tears formed as his voice broke at the sight of a homeless man holding a sign that read, We'll work for food. Mike rolled down the window, handed the man a bag of snacks and some change he had left over from a recent purchase. He then apologized to the man, explaining that that was all he had to give him. The man thanked my son several times, and I could hear the emotion in his voice. Once we were on our way again, Mike asked me if what he had done was okay. Okay? My mama's heart was bursting with pride and perhaps some remorse as well. I hadn't even noticed the man. To be honest, sometimes I not only pretend I don't see persons on the side of the road, but I judge and condemn them without caring to know their story. And yet Jesus made it clear that his mission on earth was to those in need, those who were downtrodden or sick. He didn't look the other way. He didn't run from them. He ran toward them. We're called to be Christ-like, full of compassion and mercy. It's not our place to judge, but it is our place to care. And the thought for today is this. I will choose to see others through the eyes of Jesus. That's right. Dear Lord, help us to see others the way that you see them. And may this perspective lead us to action. Amen.